Greetings, everybody. Mike Emmerich here. Eddie Olchek alongside Ray Ferraro down at ice level. Tonight, we have a thrilling evening of hockey ahead. Tonight's matchup will feature some thrilling talent. And let's head down to ice level. Here's Ray Ferraro. The playoffs are the best time of the year, guys. And so we remember back to qualifying for a playoff series for the first time. You get yourself into the playoffs, you're so nervous you can't get started quick enough. This is the very best time of the year. And the opening face-off is here. The playoffs, the best time of year, and we begin. Mike Emmerich here, Eddie Olchek next to me. Eyesight is Ray Ferraro. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Down near the players is Ray Ferraro. This series has been analyzed 15 ways from Tuesday. Everybody's got their opinion in. Now you have to see how it plays out. The guys can't wait to get going. New York's got it. Fires! Not able to do that well. Pittsburgh setting up an offense from the wing. Decides to head for the corner. Keeps it in the zone with that interception. Shoots one. Great save. Thrown to the slot. The Penguins with a neutral zone possession along the way. Can start the attack going in the zone. And the pickup. Pass attempt to Kessel. Gathered up again by Letty. Loose puck blocked off by Evgeny Malkin. Letty's hooked on this play, and the arm of the referee is high. The Penguins are given a hooking minor. This was okay about 10 years ago. Not anymore. That's a hooking call. New York's power play will have its first chance of the game. This is a power play earned in a scoreless game. Their power play can now get them on the board and give them a lead. It's dumped in. Let's see what the power play can generate as it's gathered in by Boychuk. Couldn't get it out. Canes that offensive line. On through the corner. Back and forth they go between the points. Puck loose, denied by the roadblock. Very important steal for him. Pittsburgh's gotten it back out. They check the clock, get ready to defend. Snapping a pass to Pavillier. And now it's directed to Everly. Pittsburgh's done a remarkable job of killing off the penalty. Back at full strength. What a ripper! The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. Back to the point. Point to point pass. Shot blocked. He scored! Oh, I take that back. No goal! The referee waved that one off. I'm not too sure about that call. They're going to go upstairs and take another look, and we will too. The playoff series now has its first goal. The first lead has been established. The Islanders goal is going to count on. The crowd is up on their feet as they start to celebrate. Some shots, only one goal. Of opportunities, love the mindset of getting pucks and people to the net. And that's a face off win. Puck is thrown to Alexia. Brings it in for an attack. Made that work for him in goal. Passing one off now to Steven Gianta. Five minutes, 23 seconds. Takes it from the boards and looks on. A point hammer shot. He was standing in the lane and got some of Pitching it to Alexia. Stood up there. Around through the corner right now. Terrific determination by Letty.
They're getting ready to strike. Did not miss by much. Johnson just missed on that attempt. Heaves one. Well done with that pass. Collected in the corner. Throws it. Big pad save. Need to get rid of it. Smart recovery by Hornquist. Looking to make a play from behind. Terrific save. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. with a face-off win. Directing that one to Everly. In with it now. Trying for it. Shot. It's off his pad. And on top of that, another great stop. Trying to go to Gensel. Terrific fake-out. Wonderful stop. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Won that face off. Now what? Let's it go. He had a great chance, but he has just missed the net. You're not going to hit that much harder than he did. Unfortunately, he just misses the net. Terrific save, terrific opportunity. A timely save, that is tremendously tremendous. If you're gonna sell the deke, you better sell it a lot harder than that. The goalie was there to make a rather routine save. A little past halfway here in the first. The Islanders lead 1-0. Critical face-off win there. Pitching this one to Pearson. Pittsburgh's winging it at neutral ice. Didn't handle it very well. Free puck. And down to Malkin. Heads on to the corner. Chip to Kessel. Fires a shot. And a save. And he puts the glove on it and stops playing. They won that face off, try to generate something. What a ripper from the point. Save. A shot. Had it away. Incredible save. Looking to Barzell. Great poke check there. He lifts the stick and swipes it. Nice job. Bumped, loses it. Takes it right back. And he dumps it in. Spike down. Free puck now. The Islanders are skating it up at neutralize. Good save there. Carries it on in from center. Wheeling behind and continuing to move. They keep working hard on the boards. Terrific poke check by Everly. The Islanders are at the wing in neutralize. Propelled to Everly. A one-timer! Save! Pretty run-of-the-mill stop for the goaltender. He's got a clean look. It's a shot without much velocity.
The Islanders prevailing on the faceoff. Say! Couldn't do what he wanted. Puck grab, what's next? That pass was off the mark, so they'll have to try it again, organizing at center. Moving it to Everly. Pass attempt to Mata. The Penguins have it at center ice. Cuts off the passing lane in the defensive zone. Marvelous save. No time on that one. You got to think that's a game-changing save there. Murray's blocker save is a pretty routine one. He's in good position, and he deflects this out of danger. They win the draw. What next? Slides it to the point. Slid to Pulak. Snapping a pass to Pavillier. He loads it up. Great glove save. That puck is held, and the whistle stops playing. As soon as the goaltender reads the release of the shot, he drops to the butterfly and makes a really easy stop. job on the draw. And now it's directed to Malkin. The Penguins skated up on the side. That's how you break up a play. It is hard work here to get the puck free. On to Pulak. Steps in from the neutral zone. Can he generate something? Laid on to Clutterbuck. Oh, and it's off the mark. That's what I would call a great A scoring chance, but the shot just missed the target. The Penguins get a two-minute penalty for tripping. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. Player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. New York's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. After an ineffective power play earlier in the game, let's see if they can get a little more organized, get the puck into the zone and get it on net far more frequently. Shoots! Oh, big rebound here! Using the point, he's got it. Marvelous save by Murray! The Penguins shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Muscled right off it. Trying to get it back out of the zone. He got rid of it. So on this power play, they will resume from their own end of the ice. Mishandled thanks to the roadblock. Save there. Save! Both of them got all of that one. The Penguins have killed off the penalty. Penalty box is empty for them. The Islanders see the clock getting down to the smaller numbers now, but still time to get it back up ice. That's a great deflection there. Good stick. Puck is thrown to Pavillier. That puck's loose. Deflected away. A brilliant save at the horn. First period has been completed. And so intermission activities are forthcoming, but the players get a breather. It's a one nothing game. A look at the shots on goal. They're pretty overwhelming. A whopping 16 for the Islanders and nine for Pittsburgh. New York's netminder has fashioned a goose egg on the opposition side of the scoreboard. At the end of this period, we are still thinking about the last huge save, which was this one right back after this.
One period played. A second period is about to begin. What do you think of what we've seen so far? The Penguins are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they got to eliminate those turnovers. He cut that one off in the defensive end. Gathered up again by Letty. The Islanders skated up on the side. Chip to Letty. Back in his defensive end to get it. Steps across that line. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Puck loose, he couldn't get by. A backhand shot, handled with the stick. Takes a shot. Score! His first playoff goal. What a great memory for him. Quick hands, put himself in a position to score on the forehand. Eddie, the goalie can only do so much. He's got too much time to make this wonderful deke, and the shot goes up over top of him. The Islanders have now enlarged their lead to two to nothing. At the rate they're going in this game, they might make it three fast. They've won the faceoff. Penguins are driving it from the wing. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Cuts off that pass in the attacking zone. Right to the point. Propelled to Malkin. Gets that one on a cross. Got his stick on the shot! The Islanders have it along the side at mid-ice. He's got it. Scooped up by Kessel. Passing one off now to Malkin. Looking from the corner. Many yards gained to Mata. Puck free. Rister from the slot. Can't get it on net. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Wow, this looked like it was going in for sure but he was able to make the save on that puck that changed directions. Just a hair under four minutes gone. New York's got the lead in this game, two to nothing. Clean win on the draw. New York starting from their own zone. Nicely received at the point. Slid to Boychuk. Let's it go. No! Oh, man, I haven't seen a shot miss the net by that, but that's got to be 10 feet wide. What a joke. Pressure now. Gains the zone and looks over his options. In the slot. Terrific shot, but a great point-blank save. He's locked in now. Great save. He's got that at center. Stole that pass away in his own end. Wow, look at him. He's got a long way to go. Does he have enough gas? Pitching it to Steven Gianta. Tremendous hit. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. One-timer. Got that. Tremendous scoring chance. New York's on the move in the defensive zone. On to Clutterbuck. Shutout positioning by Johnson. Near the boards. Is able to move on in. Nice work by Letty. Directing that one to Barzell. Just like shootout. Around through the corner. Has it picked up. And he holds on, and the whistle stops playing. Leonard's lucky, just got a piece of that, but it was enough to make the stop.
driving in from no man's land. Laid on to Lee. What a terrific save. Pittsburgh's been a step slow throughout this contest. Their goaltender has saved them so many times. The fact that they're within a stone's throw of this game's kind of a miracle. Has it in his own end. Pittsburgh's in the neutral zone along the way. He wheels behind. Banks it ahead to Hornquist. Let's a shot go. Just couldn't find the target. When the puck sounds hard, when it hits the end boards, that means you've missed the net. Scoring chances handed away. Quick wrist shot. Terrific shot, but a save. That shift was looking really dangerous with all that pressure. The goalie finally got possession. He freezes the puck to slow things down. Well, that's not challenging in the least. The goaltender's able to make the stop. He's got a clean line to see it. There's no challenge there. Leonard's been the one key reason that his team's been able to hold on to this lead. He's faced a high percentage of top quality shots. He stopped virtually everything. Chip to Pellick. Pittsburgh's along the wing at center ice. Up to the point. And he picks it up. Gains the zone. Passes into unhindered terrain. Swept on to Pellick. Oh, what a hit that one was. Malkin's play with the puck is known throughout the league, but when he lays the body on, everybody wakes up. Goalie's one of the six guys on the ice. He can pass. He did that. And he gains the zone. Smart recovery by Johnson. Skates it into the zone. He takes that one right ahead. Good pass. And they've got it again. It's dumped in. Collected by Letty. That didn't go like he wanted. Ah, oh, that's a good quick poke check there. Trying to go to Phil Pula. The poke check worked. Pitching this one to Johnson. Pittsburgh's on the move up the wing. Terrific determination by Clutterbuck. Propelled to Steven Gianta. Looking to Johnston. That puck is loose on a good defensive play. Got that pass in his own end. Steven Gianta's turnover has his coach jumping up and down, literally on the bench. So angry that his team turned the puck over in that case. The Penguins up the wing lock the puck. And angled to Dumoulin. He shot him right down. Took that away in his own zone. A point hammer shot. Great save. Moving it to Rust. Pass attempt to Crosby. Did not go very well that time. Loose puck. A shot. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. I once had a coach tell me, hit or be hit. There is an example of getting yourself into the game. To Gensel. Snapping a pass to Dumoulin. Slid to Pellick. Gains the zone. Corrals it. He throws it there. Kick save. Outstanding. That's a free puck thanks to the play by Everly. And at an angle to Kunako. Turned away with the stick. And now it's directed to Gensel. On to Everly. Here's a one-timer. Blockered away. The cursed goals are the ones in the first minute and the last. Will we see one here? Laid on to Pearson. 
Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Puck is thrown to Kunak. The Islanders have the puck at center ice. Back on his stick. Outstanding body contact. Well, you're not going to find a place to hide out there. This is a big boy period. Everybody finishing their checks all over the ice. Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. And we look at a very impressive shots on goal board after two periods. 23 for the Islanders and 19 for the Penguins. The Islanders have that two-goal lead. The insurance goal seemed like a long time ago, but they've played really solid since then. We'll be back in a moment. Two periods played, one period ahead. What are your thoughts so far, Eddie? Pittsburgh's a bounce away from getting right back in this game. One area of concern has been their time of possession. They have not had the puck a lot in this game. The third period has begun. Let's see what we get here. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Locks on that to Letty. Good deflection try, but off the mark. Tip by the stick. That's just good fundamental defense. Really solid possession and pressure. Not done yet, though. Skates out with it. Hatchets it. Had it away. Picked up by the defense. Chip to Crosby. Shoots one. Great glove grab. Been a long time since this wasn't the garden variety stop for a goalie. Down in the butterfly, turned aside. Face-off work. Passing one off now to Letty. The Islanders with possession up the wing. Puck grab. They're ready to go. A shot. Waffle boarded. Couldn't get through and retain possession. Pitching it to Alexia. Directing that one to Mata. Trying to go to Kessel. He takes that point pass. That was a big hit. Kessel's often the object of a target. He's so good, nobody wants to give him much room. But he gets tagged there. Onside. Propelled to Mata. Looks ahead to start something. Skilled play by Broussard. Cut off that pass at center ice. Shoot! Score! Three in a row! The goalie thinks he's got the bottom half of the net covered. Obviously, he doesn't as this goes by him on the low stick side. New York's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period for the opposition. At least that is fortunate. Pittsburgh's won that neutral zone faceoff. Oh, the pass just didn't work. Skill play by Hornquist. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. Under five minutes have been played. New York's widened the margin even more with that recent goal. They're up by three. The Islanders with a clean win on the draw. Pitching this one to Clutterbuck. Taken away. Made that stop. New York's carrying on up the wing. He's got that point pass. 
Receives that pass from the other side. Oh, great cut. Leads that charge into the zone. He gets it back. Shoots. He's got that pass at the point. On the outside, a shot. The Islanders have possession in their own end. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. The Penguins are boxed on a tripping line. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. This power play has to find a way to get more people to the net. Eddie, I'm with you on that. Power play beginning. They didn't take advantage on the power play earlier in the game. Let's see if they can jump on the board here. Six minutes, three, six seconds. Slid to Rust. That's a good pad save. Dogged determination there by Broussard. Oh, the puck's in the net. It's a goal. All kinds of odd goals happen from time to time. This one just works its way in. The Penguins have gotten this game back to a two-goal deficit for them. There's still time here in the third. Let's see what happens next. And they've won the faceoff. And he dumps it in. Looking to lead. Moving it to Bailey. Crosses that line. Mishandled thanks to the roadblock. Shot. That shot came from right in front. Score! That's his first playoff goal. was in a ready position to accept that puck and put it in as a one-timer. Really don't know if he could do much more than that. He's in the right shape. He drops to the butterfly to cover the bottom half of the net, but this is perfect up over top of him. New York's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. The Islanders win the draw. What's next? On to Hickey. Loose puck, the defense got in the way. Seven minutes, 50 Shoots one, just missed the crossbar. The Penguins look to make a difference up the wing. Carries it to the corner. Laid on to Barzell. Nicely into the zone. Chip to Barzell. A shot, great point blank save. His perfect positioning allowed him to shut down that chance. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Defensive zone win. Good work along the boards. Good jab with the stick there. Can start the attack going in the zone. Shoots one off target. Propelled to Boychuk. Pass attempt to Babillier. Feeds the point. Carries it to the corner. Shot on. Wonderful stop. The defenders caught a break here. Lots of pressure in their end of the ice, but the goalie freezes the puck and they can catch their breath. Alexiak's shoulder is right through the opposing player. That is a great hit. Over nine minutes to go. They've scored again. Depending on which book you read, three may be the most dangerous hockey lead. We'll find out. Good stick there, so no complete pass. 
It's dumped in. Puck free, roadblock by Boychuk. Snapping a pass to Kunakel. Lost possession there. And he steps across the line. World class deep there. Wide of the net. Not often you get in that prime scoring area with the puck on your stick, and then your stick breaks. This is tiring labor. A kick pass out of that. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. To Kunako. Canes that offensive line. Nice job done with the stick. A poke check frees things up a bit. Let's it go. Just missed high. Boom, they came together that time, didn't they? He was looking to finish his check, and he lines up his man right up against the boards. That one is pointed to him. The Islanders in their own end love that puck along. Broke it up. Into the attacking end. Long lead pass to Letty. Oh, great save there. Not much room to work, but he got a good shot away. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. Slid to Pearson. Shoots. Outstanding point blank save. Makes that play deep. And now it's directed to Pearson. Puck is thrown to Latang. Gives it over to the point. Shoots it off. The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. Outlet up the middle to Barzell. Whoa, what a play! They can't be that sloppy with the puck, guys. Every time they get it, they have to make as sure a play as they possibly can. Brings it in for an attack. On to lead. Got it at the point. Let's a shot fly. Hand it away with authority. The Penguins have it in the defensive zone. That's great defense. Great stick. No chance on that pass. Knifing his way near the boards. That one's cornered on the dump. Passing one off now to lead. Pitching it to Pulak. Komarov's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. Penalty has just been handed out. Not much doubt to the outcome of this one. The Penguins guilty of a minor penalty for using the stick blade. Just a hook. Uh, more times than not, Doc, anytime you reach in around a player's hands that has the puck, you're going to get a hooking minor. The Islanders get another power play chance here. They've had some effectiveness on their power play and generated a lot around the net. Let's see if that continues. They should be really confident as they enter the power play again. You've already got one power play goal in your back pocket. You'd like to do it again. Directing that one to Rust. In with it now. Laid on to Alexia. So we're into the last minute. All is academic here. Has that pass off the boards. Fantastic shutdown. Good defensive read with that one. That puck flopped over the glass and is out of play, and a fan from Corona, Ontario came up with it. Penguins control from the neutral zone. Free puck off a defender there. The Islanders are starting back in the defensive zone. Carries it up the side. Chip to Pearson. Wonderful chance was set up and the pass just goes wide. Gives it to the point. Now that's a solid save.
foot forward and come away with a win. The Islanders go to center ice. They pay one last tribute to the fans with the yes, yes, yes. Playoff hockey always is special. We hope this one was for you. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.